Hey guys, welcome to today's video where we're going to show you the new message template type that you can use inside of all of your WhatsApp chatbots. That is WhatsApp Carousel. So that means that if you are going to create a new, uh, so let's go towards the WhatsApp message template first, right? If you go towards contents inside your chatbot, you can go towards message templates. You will have an overview of all your existing templates. From here, we can create a new one and we can give it a name. So for example, um, this could be menu options. There we go. And then under the category, you will have a carousel. And that means that you can send a single message accompanied by a set of up to 10 different kinds of carousel cards. So basically a really nice display of your content directly inside of the WhatsApp channel, basically the same as the gallery cards inside of Messenger and Instagram, for example, right? So that is something that you can set up. Um, so let's say we're going for a carousel. You can give it a body text, right? Then you can determine the cards. So this is just one card. And as mentioned, you can basically create up to 10 different kinds of cards. As you can see here, you'll then have the one through 10 display cards. And let's keep it at two for now. Then you can give it a header image, right? So this is the header image, or you can give it a video. So that's totally up to you. And uh, the carousel supports both image and video. For now, let's go with image. And from the image, you can just grab it from your gallery, download it from your computer or upload it from your, from your computer rather. And then you will be able to connect it, right? So it would look something like this. Uh, so let's say I'm going to go and I want to give an option for my ticketing template in this case. And then I'm going to write some content. After you're done with the body content, you can also go with the button one or button two. And if we take a look here, it could be a reply button, a phone button, a static URL button, or a dynamic URL button, right? So that is something that you can set up totally yourself if you so need it. For example, you could say, okay, I want a static URL button and that button states, uh, learn more, for example, and then you have the website URL or the link towards your video. Now you can do the same with button two either no button to or just a reply phone static URL or dynamic URL button. Once done, you go towards card two and that way you will be able to set up a maximum of 10 different kinds of cards. Once done, you can say send to review and then it will be sent for submission, right? For approval. Once done, it will show up under the marketing category. Okay, so even though you're going to create one with the carousel category, it will show up under the marketing category. So this is a meta type of issue slash category that we get back, uh, but just know that it's falling under the marketing category. Now, I already set it up, and if we take a look at the preview, for example, as you can see here, please find new content below, and then want to learn how to write. This is regarding a video of mine, and if I take another look, this is also regarding another video of mine. So if I go inside the flow itself, it would look something like this, where you will upload your two card images, as you can see here, and the rest is already done in this case on the template creation. Again, you can also go back towards the template creation and then instead of going with static data, right? You can also go with a variable. And then that variable you can dynamically populate when sending the message template itself. So in that case, it's not a static carousel template, but you can give it dynamic content, which you can use for multiple purposes. So that is something that you could do. For now, let's take a look at how this looks like on the um, WhatsApp app. Do note that this is only supported on the mobile app, the desktop app, as well as the um, as well as the other apps, uh, so on iPad, I believe, uh, might not be compatible. I only know that it's working 100% on mobile phones if you've updated towards the most recent version of your WhatsApp. So if we're going to preview this, so let's go and preview this step. So we just switch over to my phone, and as you can see, we now get a carousel looking kind of message template, right? Just like inside of Messenger, inside of Instagram, we're now able to display a carousel using a message template. So. This one is just two videos I just tested, right? So a video about how to write more human-like um, prompts inside of AI, as well as a Gitbook video. And if I press this, it will go towards the specific section, so the specific URL. And in this case, I just set it towards going towards my website. And the same will be for this one. It was just some dummy links that I set up. But as you can see, it works perfectly and really, really easily to use. And it's a really smooth effect for users. So go try out the WhatsApp message carousel. And if you have any questions, do let us know and we'll try to answer them as soon as possible. For now, have a great day. Take care and talk soon.